William Penn was born into a wealthy family on October 14, 1644, in London, England. His father was Sir Admiral William Penn, a Royal Navy officer, and his mother was Margaret Jasper. Since his family was rich, young William went to Shigwell School and later got private tutors. At the age of 16, he went to Oxford and Christ Church. Penn was expelled from Oxford for having his own services in his room instead of attending chapel. At the age of 22, Penn officially became a Quaker, but his father was not pleased since he was a Navy officer. Quakers never fought or believed in violence. They were also against slavery. Penn was put into jail for attending Quaker meetings, but released because of his famous father. Sir Penn was not happy with his son, so he kicked Penn out of the house, and he was homeless and lived with other Quakers for a while. Penn started to write, but he was again put into jail and continued to write in prison. While in jail, his father became very ill but he also became supportive about the Quakers and left Penn a very large fortune when he died in 1670. Because practicing religions other than the Church of England resulted in jail time, Penn asked King Charles II for land in the New World, and surprisingly, he said yes. Shortly after, Penn married Gully... Guillema Maria Springett? Guillema Maria Springett. From a well known Quaker family. Because Penn now owned the land, he and a hundred other Quakers left for the New World. He wished to make friends with Native Americans nearby and the land to be free for every religion. He named the land Sylvania, which means the woods, but changed it to Pennsylvania after his father. He had already designed the land with a grid system. When they arrived, they did in fact make peace with the nearby Native Americans, and the new grid system was a huge success. The government was also doing well, protecting and keeping the rights of the citizens. Two years after, in 1684, there were 4,000 people living there. The same year, he had to go back to England to resolve a border issue with Lord Baltimore between Maryland and Pennsylvania. Ten years later, Guglielma Maria Springett died. But Penn married to Hannah Caldwell in 1696. At one point, he was even at debtor's prison. In 1699, he finally returned to Pennsylvania, where things were going smoothly. But again, he went back to England, where he died of a stroke in 1718.